As the holiday shopping season ramps up, stores at the outlet mall in St. Augustine are dealing with thousands of dollars of merchandise stolen in recent days. To date, the St. Johns County Sheriff's Office says there have been 76 thefts at the premium outlet mall since the beginning of the year. There have been another 22 thefts at stores on Outlet Mall Boulevard. News for Jack's reporter Eric Avigny joining us live to explain what's happening and why store theft is costing all of us, the consumers. Eric. Well, let me break it down for you. Anytime a thief or group of thieves enter a store much like this one and steal hundreds, if not thousands of dollars worth of clothing, the owners of the store take a financial hit and to recoup from that financial hit, you, the consumer, may sometimes end up paying higher prices. Take a very good look at the people in these surveillance photos. They're all wanted by the St. Johns County Sheriff's Office in connection to recent thefts at the St. Augustine Outlet Mall in recent days thefts of thousands of dollars worth of clothing and other items. Authorities say in general, single thieves and sometimes groups of thieves working together are boldly committing retail theft. They're walking in and stealing $1,000, $2,000 worth of items, many times from the same shelf. According to these complaint reports, one of the stores at the outlet mall was targeted two times within a 48-hour time frame. Sometimes we see it a couple times a week and other times we may St. John's County Sheriff's Office spokesperson so Chuck Mulligan says some of the stores are being targeted because their front door is just a step away from the parking lot. Once you step out the door, you're in the parking lot, and if you have a car waiting to pick you up when you exit, uh, you're quite, quite frankly, you're in the car and you're driving out through the parking lot, you know, just that fast. The National Retail Federation identifies the loss of merchandise as inventory shrinkage. The Federation says inventory shrinkage is costing the U.S. retail industry billions of dollars each year. The Federation also says 36 percent of retail shrinkage is the result of shoplifting. Unfortunately, the cost of retail shrinkage can get handed down to the customer. Anytime someone steals, it's, it's truly stealing from all of us because it does in the end come back to the, to the consumer who's walking in to make a purchase. Now, as for the thousands of dollars worth of merchandise that was stolen from the outlet malls recently, authorities believe that merchandise will likely end up sold online. Reporting live, Eric Avignet, Channel 4, The Local Station.